Hey guys, welcome to the official first video of Pixel Insane. My name is Alessio. I do 3D design, art in Blender and After Effects, which are my favorite software to use. And with today's first video, what I want to do is to share a free material library that I made in Blender for you to download for free. So let's jump into Blender. This is my default scene, which I made, obviously. Just a little disclaimer before I start. Yes, the materials are free to download, but I only require for you to subscribe to my channel, follow me on Instagram, all the links are in the description below. And, you know, if you feel generous, you can donate on the website. So let's jump into it. We go to the website, link is in the description down below. What you need to do is to click on products and then free materials. Or from the top, you can go and simply click free materials. This will take you to a sign up page, so you'll become a member of the website. In order to download the files, this is the only way you can do it, but it's pretty easy and straightforward. It's like a normal sign up, whatever. You can sign up with Facebook, sign up with Google or with your email. So this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to click login. I'm going to log in with my email, select it and log in. And voila, you're going to be directed to this page. This is the first material that we're going to download. So this is the car paint. You can see all the colors right there. So let's do it. Let's download the file. Let's put it in our desktop. We're just going to right click and extract all the files in the folder car paint. Yes. Open the folder. And here we go. We have a car paint dot blend file. You can either open the file itself or append the material, which we're going to do both. So we're going to open the file, go to the desktop car paint. Here it is. And we're going to open the file. Let's close this. So this is what you're going to see. You're going to see a sphere with the material applied and it's pretty straightforward. We can jump into the shading editor just to view it and to view the material itself. The first thing you can do is to change the color from blue to orange, from orange to green from green to red, from red to silver. Also, you have your own custom color, so you can just click it and choose whatever you want. You can navigate into the paint color tab by just press selecting it and pressing tab and you can see the setup. You can play with all the settings. You can play with the roughness. Obviously, changing the color will change the roughness. Moving the slider, see? And it's connected to a Voronoi texture. It's a really, really small. We can change the scale to a hundred just to, to show it. And with the node Wrangler installed and active, you can shift control any of the elements in there and preview them singularly. So there we go. And now the principal shader, and we're going to go back to the scale of 500. It's pretty easy. We can go to render mode and see how it looks. There's no lights, so yeah, <laughs> that's how it looks. <laughs> we are back in the default Blender setup, so we are going to append the material. So we're going to go click append, and go to desktop, type car, car paint, click it, and then go to material. And we're going to click on material, and you can see it right there. Click on it, append, and now I can just select the object, go to the material tab, and select it from the drop down menu. And voila, we have it, our perfect car paint material. And again, we can always change the color. Let's do it again with the custom one. It's pretty cool. You can change it. You can change the roughness. Again, pretty easy. Change it like that. And uh, it's very, very versatile. It's very easy. Also, it's very fast on the viewport. I gotta say, it's pretty fast and renders really fast too. So maybe, yeah, let's give it a render and see what it looks like. Let's go to camera mode, press F12, and let's give it a render. One eternity later. And voila, 18 seconds later, we have our render and it looks pretty cool. Again, it's very customizable, not super crazy, but still for quick stuff, it's really, really good. That's it really. All you need to do is go to the website, follow the instruction, download your uh, free material, Make sure you subscribe to this channel and follow me on Instagram. All the links are in the description down below. I just want to show you what you're going to get next. This is the full library so far. It's pretty cool. If you want, you can let me know in the comments down below which material you want me to release next week and uh, I'll do that. 
I will release one material per week, so make sure to subscribe and turn on the bell notification for the next. That's it for this video. My name is Alessio, this is Pixel Insane. Thank you so much for watching and I'll catch you on the next one.